Hey guys, Napier's Asylum. So, as you can see from my shirt, I went ahead and shot this. Same night I shot Mr. J's intro. Want to introduce Sydney. Sydney is a cinnamon clown. So you can see with Sydney, her back stripe is not as uh, contrasted to the rest of her body. Cinnamons typically have a darker color. I have to kind of watch where I have her. The vent above me here is blowing some cold air, so obviously I don't want to get her too cold. Um, Sydney is a beautiful, beautiful young lady. Um, hopefully we'll be able to get her sized up. Realistically, I'm thinking probably two years before I get to breed her just based upon her eating habits. Right now, unfortunately, the only thing that I've been able to get her to eat against what I like to do is live mice. So not been too happy about that, but I obviously want her to eat. I want her to be happy. I want her little belly to be full so we can get her to the point where we can breed her. She's got the cutest little face. Like that. Um, we got her out at Tinley at Bailey and Bailey was the breeder. So much thanks to them. She has 50% hep hypo. Um, there you go. Kind of see her a little bit more. As you can see, she is a little more docile than Mr. J. He was kind of all over the place. Sydney is my baby when it comes to just laying down. I try to keep away from her head. I don't want her. She is head shy, as most of them. And honestly, I am not the most comfortable around snakes. And, you know, that's part of the reason why I got into snakes was to face my fear when it came to snakes. Um, we all seen the video of the reticulate latching on to the uh, girl's arm out of the bin. Honestly, when they jerk their head back, it scares me too. No fault of their own. But as I become handle them more, as I handle them more, I should say, and become more comfortable with them, um, it's becoming easier. Uh, it's letting me be a little more recognizing, allows me to recognize a little bit more of how to handle the snake and how to make them feel more comfortable so they can become a better, better animal. But like with everything else, they are wild animals. You know, we do breed them. You know, you take some of that wildness out of them after years and years of breeding just like we did with dogs and that but as you guys are fully aware dogs bite cats bite no matter how many years of domestication we have and the best adage that i heard is anything with a mouth can bite so that's true i've been bitten by my day gecko and i've been bitten by a leopard gecko um both times they were just didn't like the fact that I was holding them. Part of it is because I had to hold the leopard gecko. I had to get the shed off of him before um, it became too much of an issue for him. So, but that right there, once again, is my girl Sydney. You can see how beautiful she is. So, once thank you guys for watching the video, taking your time out of your day to watch. Hopefully you enjoyed seeing her. Hopefully you'll enjoy seeing her breed over the years and I can introduce her babies to you guys. All right. So as you can see, she's probably close to two feet long as far as her length. So there she is. She does not like the camera. <laughs> but, all right. Thank you guys. Once again, Napier's Asylum. Please like, comment, and follow. If you would, check out my page. Um, I have a lot of, I'll have a lot of um, polls on there. Uh, just to let you guys know, I got my logo ordered from 
the artist so hopefully by Friday I'll be able to put that out there and let you guys see what we've been working on maybe do a community event of having you guys kind of pick the logo or help me pick the logo and then we can maybe do depending on how, how many I get um, I got five concepts according to what he said so if I do a if I get four concepts or maybe five concepts, I might give one a, a buy that I find that I like the best. And then we may do a bracket for the other two and then have that go against the, the one that I like. We'll see what we get, okay? Once again, thank you for your time. Thank you for watching this. Kept it shorter than the other ones for sure. Thanks, guys.